viewers and subscribers welcome to emerge tv once again and we're here with another update this is one of the update them I wish me never have to do again I do one sunday i said the same thing and i'm gonna say the same thing again wish me never have to do it but as i said sunday i'm gonna say it again news don't always come in at the farmer with a lot of people come this incident have to do with a female again was killed by a common law husband um allegedly um this incident took place in saint elizabeth so we're not gonna do much talking in another video yeah all right this so is before we go further in the video don't forget to like share and subscribe emerge tv so as i said we're not gonna do much talking we're gonna play a clip from the deceased father his account of the incident and then we're gonna play a, a clip from miss kitty she had warned the female them are going in a relationship for monetary gain and she had warned the male them also say female and a property so we just have to run them two clip there and thanks for watching the video you know me sleep me and me dad my wife jump up and say wham and she rush she rush out and when she rush out me rush out after her when me go when me look me see my daughter upon the concrete and in her blood upon the weekend last week it, 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 last week saturday and take the same same care and come home I'm buying reach one. Real persons can snap, but let me say this unequivocally, right? That no one, no one has the right to take anybody's life for any kind of infidelity or any kind of investment of money or whatever it is. I don't subscribe to it. I do not agree with it. And there is, it is it is unexplainable and there is no excuse to take somebody's life on that uh, basis, okay? Uh, you, when you invest in a hairy bank, mm -hmm. uh, sometimes there, most of the time, there is no interest to get from a hairy bank. Mm -hmm. You invest at your own risk mm -hmm. and if you so choose, remember, nobody held you at gunpoint or, no, or, or tie you. you up. Nobody will force you against your will to take out your money and give to a woman. But in the same token, on the other hand, and let me say this unequivocally ladies be very careful how you get into these transactional relationships i know it is very unfortunate because a lot of young ladies nowadays are not looking for love they're looking for help they're not looking for a man they're looking for a minor and they're looking for somebody who to mind them and take care of them so that they can be kept understand that nobody is going to take lightly to you using them or you tricking them and trying to dick them and try to take their money and try to laugh at them and think it's going to be a okay when you put yourselves in these precarious situations you open yourselves to violence you open yourself to being killed to being stabbed being maimed leave the men alone if you don't want the man do not take his things leave him alone go get a job for yourself take care of yourself and have your own income if it is that you no longer want to be with this person or you no, are no longer interest you're no longer interested you don't want to continue the relationship do a clean break let your situation or your circumstance be known listen i don't think it's working out i no longer want to be with you state your case and move on but this bugger lying and the betrayal and these things because when people betrayed now um andrika and martina mm -hmm. there are times when people will step outside of their character mm -hmm. because in the heat of the moment and the passion of the moment yep. people can snap so on the one hand, nobody has the right to take anybody's that you can't take life because you can't blow breath. Leave people, girl, pick me alone. If the person no longer wants to be with you, it is his or her right. And I'm me cut your nail string and I'm and I've me carry for nine months. So back up and leave me alone. Leave the women alone. There is no there is no contract. That is signed between you and a young woman. If you so choose to minor, if you so choose to use your money, because some men use their money in lieu of or in hopes that yes, yeah, you can keep her that way. You can keep her. Ah, uh, yes, that you're gonna use to draw her in. Every bank not come with interest, and you invest at your own risk. If you want back interest, call him TV, call Scotia. What the next bank name? Him first Caribbean J and your partner. <laughs> yeah, I even partner. You have to careful because the partner pay for them. Sometimes it's very tricky, fi. Right? But Air Bank don't come with interest. There is no guarantee that a woman is going to stay with you because you have invested in her monetarily. Do not invest where you can't lose. It's true, we can't. I'm not having to lose, Martina. I can't invest anything, but don't have it. 
Me don't have it. Me don't have it. So I can't lose it. I don't have it. I don't have it. I don't have it. I don't have it. Me they are looking to miss. I don't have it. I don't have it. So don't do that, right? If you know you cannot lose this money or you know that it is going to hurt you and it's going to burn you so much if you want a next man or she gone left you after you've invested and after you have dedicated and you have put in all your financial resources in this person, you can't take no ticket off on a body because people have a mind of their own and sometimes you don't know until it's too late. If you choose to help somebody, do it out of your own benevolence and of your own choice and of your own volition but do not it is not right to take an innocent life to take anybody's life because you feel like you have invested and you mind the person and you own the person minding somebody you don't own them you own your mother you understand you don't own nobody but in the same breath on the other hand ladies be warned the man them not a fool like only think now idiot man are really their road and even if they are idiot Someone ever play fool to catch wise. Don't think that you can get into a man's life, get into his pocket, get into his bank book, and after you would have lava juice out in pocket, your thing say you got us cut out like loot up on a scooter and a <laughs> and a laugh off on one side. It's not going to work. When you do things like that, it is deleterious to your safety and of course to your own well-being. If you do not want the man, do not take his things. Do not take his things, his money under false pretense tense and then think that you're going to be an opportunist and then leave him in the lurch those things open you up to all kind of violence and sometimes it can mean your life will be on the line no way i do put your cards lay your cards on the table be open and be honest people will be hurt yes but it's better to be hurt and alive than try to be a scammer and die because nobody wants to be made a fool of. Nobody wants to be used. And at the end of the day, anybody can snap. Because guess what? Bad people do good things. And good people do bad things. Okay. Human beings all are we. And a blood run through our veins. See them way. So be very careful of your modus operandi. Because some of you out there, your man has spy out the man. Because I say, eh, I'm going to use him to get the car. I'm going to use him to get the degree. I'm going to use him to get the house. And as you get it now, you start saying, mm -hmm, pardon. I don't like him in belly too big. I don't like him in foot smell. Oh, I don't like him in my what? Oh, I don't like him in this. You never see the man belly big all along when you take the money. <laughs> when I pay a university fee, you never see him. Ed big that time. <laughs> you never see same missing with him in poor wisdom teeth them come out. You never see that time. You never see that time. But when you've got what you want, you are then now going to extricate yourself from the equation. Those things can lead to very detrimental detrimental things. And I want persons to understand on both sides. Men have no right to take a woman's life. Women, we ought to be more prudent. We ought to be more dignified and have integrity. No but I think you gotta take a man money because sometimes it may work out good for you. The man may just leave and not trouble you or bother you. But there are some men who may not have that level of control or that level of empathy and may do something that you may both regret. And so a word to the wise is sufficient. You're listening to Miss Kitty Live right here on Nationwide Night.